All right, so my eyes are already primed. I used the Tarte Shape Tape Concealer to prime my eyes. And we're gonna go in with the Modern Renaissance Palette by Anastasia Beverly Hills. And the first shade we are going to go into is going to be um, Raw Sienna. So we're gonna use Raw Sienna. And I'm using the Mikasa Blending Brush, the E330 Blending Brush. All right, now with the same brush, I'm gonna go into Real Gar. So this very um, intense, like orange color. Same brush, and just concentrating that a little bit more closely into the crease. And just windshield wiper motions, you know. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna use the Mikasa E300 brush, which is a blending brush, just a little bit shorter and more dense. Um, I'm gonna go into Venetian Red actually. I'm gonna use that color and pop that into the inner and outer corners. Okay, and now going in with Red Ochre. I'm just going to kind of pop that on top, concentrating it a little bit more into the inner and outer corners. Oh, by the way, this is a Smashbox 30 pencil brush. I'm gonna go into the Jaclyn Hill and Morphe palette, and I will take the shade called Chip, which is kind of like, it's a dark brown with a, with a um, kind of like purpley undertone with the same Smashbox pencil brush. And again, the very inner and outer corners. So now for the um, center part, I'm going to take a little bit of concealer course tar shape tape and I am going to um, kind of carve out that middle part that middle section I'm using my real techniques um, detail brush I'm gonna use the Mikasa E230 um, shader brush and gonna go in with the shade Queen from the Jaclyn Hill Morphe palette which is this one right here, it's like a bronzy gold kind of color. And it's gonna pop that into the center. And now we're gonna go in, we're gonna go back with the E300 brush from Mikasa and back into um, Venetian Red from the Anastasia palette, which is this like darker pink right here. And just kind of blend the, um, the gold and the... Okay, so what I'm actually gonna do now is take Primavera from the Anastasia palette, which is this shiny gold and very pale gold and just pop that in the very center of this um, of the gold that we have on our lids for me I find that it gives a different effect like and I like the effect that it gives when you just uh, really concentrate that color onto the very like lash line instead of doing the whole center part which I do but when you concentrate that 
on the very like on the lash line just really pack on that color right on the lash line i feel like it just i don't know it does something like i just love it's like that little twinkle that you know like i love it so to prime my face i'm gonna use fenty beauty the pro filter the soft matte pro filter instant retouch primer sorry guys So I'm going to use today the um, Maybelline the, the Maybelline Fit Me Matte and Poreless Primer in the shade 220. I've been obsessed with this. So what I like to do is like to dot it all over. Maybelline, I'm going to need you to put some pumps on these bad boys because this right here is not fun. And I'm going to use my Sigma Flat Top Kabuki F80. I'm going to go with concealer. I'm going to use the Tarte Shape Tape in Light Neutral. So now I'm going to use um, Fenty Mocha Matchstick per usual. Just kind of rub the, the tip of the brush onto the stick and then just go ahead and... Um, we're going to set the under eyes. going to use um, our CMA Translucent Powder. I'm going to use a Sigma tapered highlighting brush at F335 just to go underneath and set everything and if you hear noise in the background please excuse my family is here and of course you know loud as usual but that's okay all right so I'm gonna go in with the Kat Von D shade light contour powder palette and I'm going to use the shade Shadow Play, which is this one right here, to bronze. And I'm going to go in with the Morphe M527 uh, brush. Just tapping that in there. And let's get to it. Okay, so I'm back. I finished off the eyes, did the lower lash line. Um, hit the lower lash line with Venetian Red and Red Ochre. And um, some mascara, I used Maybelline Fit Me, I mean Maybelline Colossal Mascara. And my lashes are Coco Lashes in Goddess. And that is it for the eyes. Moving on to finish the face, I'm gonna use my Tarte Amazonian Clay Blush in Party. And then for highlight, I'm going to use the Laura Mercier um, Indiscretion Highlighter, just like a rosy gold with my Anastasia A23 brush. And now to finish off the look, I'm going to do lips. I'm going to use ColourPop um, and the I Love Sarahi collab in the shade 951. This is a ultra satin lip. So we're going to use the combination, the lip liner and the lip satin. Alright you guys, and that is the completed look for this very like cranberry festive holiday look. Um, so yeah, I love it. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and all the products used in the video will be linked down below. And yeah. I will see you in the next one. Thank you for watching. Bye.